Happy Halloween. Thanks. Go ahead. Okay, I was uh, going to get on the issue about the uh, um, ha- uh, the costumes and about the PC, uh, about the Halloween costumes, and I was basically listening to everything, the issues about even going to transgender and everything. And it's basically, you know, education or public schools, just like you said. You took the words right out of my mouth. I was sitting here thinking about it. And basically I've been studying about this progressive liberal policies that have been basically in our system. They did an um, educational test back in the 30s, an eight-year test, which actually started the public um, – the Department of Education in, in uh, 1953, and ever since they've been dumbing us down and they've been indoctrinating us, demonizing our founding fathers, putting into this ugliness where they're trying to put homosexuality as normal, and they're even take, getting into our medical... Wait, wait, what's wrong uh, with homosexuality? Well, it's, it, it's a neurological disorder, which was in the medical journal at one time. It was? Now. What kind of ridiculous yeah, claim is that? Stand out. by, Rick, yeah. stand by. We all want to talk to you more about this. We got Rick on the line in Michigan. He was responding to, I think, the issue of the transgender uh, bathrooms. Actually, I'm not really sure what the initial point of the call was, Rick, but you had mentioned something about uh, you basically said that being gay is not natural. I don't want to put words in your mouth. So no, you go no, ahead? what I was saying is that that uh, basically government has been controlling the content of information being taught in our public schools. Yeah, that's true. School. And so they're pushing these ideas, of course, that are destructive for our country, and they're taking God out of our country, uh, out of our, out of everything. And so now they're pushing also that homosexuality is a, is basically normal, when in actuality, well, it, 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 well, it's, it, it happens it's, in nature. So therefore, it's it's normal by that definition. It's at the very least natural, right? Yeah. It goes against all laws of nature. If you were to go. If you're trying to procreate in nature, I mean, I, I think we're the only animal on this planet that is doing that kind of sort of thing. Doing what and, kind of sort I'm of thing? Sorry, uh, procreating? We're the, only, uh, we're the only animal that actually thinks and reasons, and we can actually— Hold on a moment here. Now, did you just say that we're the only animal that is doing gay th- gay things? Is that what you were saying there? Uh I would imagine demonstrably false. Fa- demonstrably false. You need to not stop imagining. Lots of gay critters. Yeah, and look at the the reality and the well, evidence. The act. It's probably something they don't even know what they're doing. All right. But the well. thing is that we know how, what we're doing, and we have think and reason. We think and reason. We know that it's not you know. Do you decide? Wait, 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 wait. Do, look, you might have been born straight, and I think that's how people are. Right? They are born a certain way, and certainly most people. Yeah, they can do whatever they want to do, and if they want to do that, they can go behind the green door and shut it. But it actually don't Most have to gay people are church. doing their deeds in private, so I don't think you have to worry yeah. about that. Well, no, yeah. they go now and they want to force people into churches that go to churchgoers, and then they want to be able to perform into a gay marriage, which is actually blasphemic act right in the church. And so that but my church people, does do right? gay marriages. Well, so they should actually build a church, not go in those hundred-year-old no. ones or a thousand-year-old ones that well, go in there. They I think that they should go to the churches right. that uh, you know that want to do gay marriages for them. I mean, that's that that's their business, well, right? Some Episcopal actually, churches want to no, do that. They're being forced. They're being forced into doing something that that actually. I'm not so familiar with this case. Is there a case where a church is being forced to do a gay wedding? Um, because I would be against that. Now, if they if they if they denied it, of course, you know, like that lady that stood her ground over there was a, a city councilor or whatever she was over. She in was the, a clerk of the court, but uh, she wasn't right, a reverend. Yeah. But when she stood her ground, these some of these priests, you know, or preachers would actually give in to this PC, and so they don't want to be, you know, attacked or anything. So of course they're going to allow. Well, this the, those preachers stuff. apparently don't hold whatever that uh, that belief is very well, very well, closely. Actually, but the problem is, is that the government got involved in marriage in the first place. Marriage right. licenses became widespread because they didn't want blacks and whites getting married post Civil right. War, exactly. and right. Republicans were just fine with marriage being between one man and one woman for a very long time. They they weren't right. going out there and they weren't saying, you know what, marriage, uh, the government shouldn't be involved in marriage. Republicans were propagating it all over the place. And it's now exactly. the Republicans are interested in the libertarian stance on marriage, which is that the government shouldn't be involved. Well, we, don't, we don't mind that the marriage is all fine. They can actually go to a court and get married by the— uh, by They can the, come uh, to my church and get married if they the want. Power of the attorney, or by, by the power of the state that's uh, invested in the uh, whoever it is actually Why would you want to get married by the state? Ew, that's icky. Yeah, I mean, well, no, these no, people— I'm saying if they want to get married by, by the court so they can get the same kind of rights and stuff like that— when well, they could get married by Mark's church. You know, like that's okay, right? Married. 
Rick? Right. If they Rick? get they get it's, married, if somebody dies, right, and they get their benefits and stuff yeah. like that, they Rick, have the so, same kind of. The so I'm glad that you support that's gay marriage. That's a good thing. Uh, but you're okay with Mark's church marrying gay people, right? If they want to. Not at a church. I would. Whoa, say whoa! It's not your church. Well, they can build a church, and they can have one of all their own, and they can have that. That's fine. But if well, what they if Mark's church, church wants to allow them to uh, to get married? Why is that? Why is that a problem? They have churchgoers that are already there, that have been there praising the Lord, and they're all straight, and they go by the Lord. Do you think all God. churches b- follow your uh, belief system? No, not by my belief system. I'm talking about when people have been going to church, and all of a sudden this whole thing starts to change around. Is this all of a sudden, Mark? You said your church has been doing gay marriage. Yeah, church has been doing uh, the Quak- Quakers have been doing gay marriages exactly. for a long time. Thanks as for the have call, the, Rick. Episcopals. The Appreciate thing is, it. is that things are going to change enough. if your if your church, for whatever reason, decides to start doing gay marriages, and you don't want that. Do what they did it, 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 right here in uh, in the Monadnock region. A church splinter. Had a schi- yeah, had yeah. a schism over this. There were two buildings. Really? They took two buildings. They went to two different places. Which church? Um, it's I, I don't know the name okay. of it, honestly. Yeah, I was just curious what the re- religion was. Um, I don't know. I drive by it. I really don't pay much How attention. How did you hear about that? Was it in the news? It was a uh, local chit chat. Huh. Okay. So I don't know the specifics of it. What you know, whatever. Let's what, talk. Huh? Why? I, I I can't understand why people would want to go to a church where they don't want to perform a wedding for them. Right? Like, I wouldn't, yeah. if I was gay, I wouldn't want to go to a church. If, as a matter of fact, Absolutely. if I was straight, I wouldn't want to go to a church where they're like, oh, we're just not going to deal with uh, you, uh, you know, your, your friends around here.